I did not mean to press the stop button because I was a bike rider. <laughs> yeah. Hey guys, RC Jedi here. Um, I'm going to run this um, HSP verdict. This one is basically bone stock. Um, this is it's Christmas Day, so it's its first run. So I am going to run a 2S lipo next time. So yeah, this is running the 7.2 volt nickel metal hydride battery. So let's get this going real quick. This is running the brush, this is a brushed vehicle, so it's not going to be like super quick as like some of the ones that I've previously had, like my WL Toys 12428 Green Desert Truck. So I used to have one of them, and, I, and this car sort of reminds me of that, but this one is probably not as quick. And I'm only going slow just to break the motor in. Because this is never, this is on its first battery pack. So with all my RCs that I buy, I make sure I run the um, car um, bone stock. I never change any um, thing on the car. Like as you say, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. So this car is running the same HSP servo that you get with the um, with all the brushed and brushless cars. Um, this is running a 7.2 volt battery. As you say, this is basically running brand new, never been ran before. I'm pretty sure it says 30 kilometers now on the website. Hobbywarehouse.com.au. Um, when I last checked, they were out of stock. But I'm pretty sure after Christmas, um, these will be back in stock. Now I'm just trying to hold my phone. Oh, jeez. So this car does have an okay turning radius. I might do a skate park video with this car. I'm not going to put too much power through it. This car is um, pretty good for the beginner. And also parts, you can get hold of them. So I might take this thing off-roading, maybe next video, take it off-road. But first few runs of this buggy, I'm not going to drive it off-road first run. I am going to get a, some different tyres for it. And also, I did duct tape the body shell because... Um, a lot of these HSP cars, the body shells are very weak. So let me just bring it in and first run impressions. So this car does run pretty well um, for its um, price. Um, I will um, put a 2S LiPo in. Um, after this video, like I might do it off camera for a 2S run to see how it performs. Um, Cause I don't want to sit, dr keep driving it on video because this video is over four minutes long. I will um, put in a different, um, maybe another motor in it. Um, maybe, because um, I wasn't going full throttle, but um, this RC um, might be one of these RCs that might be good for the beginner at starting out in the RC hobby um, because and besides this car is a very good little um, car um, so um, yeah so this is the first run and first in first run drive um, of the HSP verdict um, you can buy this thing on hobbywarehouse.com.au um, for a good price of under 200 under $300 
um, which is a good deal for a car. Um, I probably might check if this thing has bushes or bearings. If not, I might upgrade to bore bearings. So, um, yeah, so this is the HSP verdict. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on any more videos. So, yeah, this is RC Jedi. Subscribe, stay tuned for more RC content and... So yeah, you have a good one everyone. Have a good have a good Merry Christmas. And I'll look forward to catching up on like in the new year. Um so yeah, um a lot of a lot of RC content coming up. So have a good Christmas you all. And so yeah, cuz I'm filming this on Christmas day of course cuz I just got this thing for Christmas. So yep, so this is RC Jedi signing off.